IDF Chief Herzia Levy says that Hamas is trying to hide the outcome of Saturday's airstrike in Khan Yunus, targeting its military commander, Mohammed Def. The IDF confirmed that Khan Yunus Brigade Commander Rafa Salameh was killed in the deadly Israeli strike on an above-ground hidden Hamas encampment. Halevi gave no update on the fate of Def, the elusive commander of Hamas's military wing. The IDF chief said that the army is creating all of the pressure needed on Hamas to move forward to reach a hostage for ceasefire deal. Calling the return of the hostages a moral imperative, Halevi insisted that the IDF can return and fight with great intensity after the potential truce. Despite reports to the contrary, the Hamas terror group has not withdrawn from ceasefire for truce talks after this weekend's Israeli airstrike in Khan Yunus, targeting its military commander, Mohammed Def. The statement from the group denied that Hamas had left or suspended the talks as a result of the Israeli strike. The announcement did blame Prime Minister Netanyahu with attempting to sabotage a potential agreement. Prime Minister Netanyahu has reportedly hardened the Israeli negotiating stance in light of reported intelligence showing Hamas needs a ceasefire agreement due to its weakening military position. Ramped up hostage deal talks in Doha and Cairo took place through much of last week and contacts are ongoing. The current round of talks are based on an Israeli proposal. The talks stalled in June, but a recent reworking of the agreement's language opened the door for renewed negotiations. In what could become the largest exit in Israeli history, the Wall Street Journal is reporting that Google is close to a deal to buy cybersecurity startup Wiz for $23 billion. Google's parent company Alphabet is reportedly in advanced talks to buy Wiz in what would be its largest acquisition ever. Neither company has spoken publicly about the potential deal, but the Wall Street Journal says it could come together soon. Wiz was founded by CEO Asaf Rappaport. His team has been working working together for more than 20 years. In a precursor to the deal, Wiz predicted in May that this will be a year of consolidation in the field of cybersecurity. Experience the power of truth with ILTV News. If you're looking for quality content and captivating visuals, join our news community and become an integral part of our team as we embark on a mission to unveil the real Israel dismantling the web of lies and misinformation that surround reporting on Israel. By subscribing to ILTV News, you will not only have access to the latest updates, but you will also amplify our message, creating a ripple effect that carries the truth far and wide. Subscribe today and help reshape the narrative, available on the web, Android, and Apple.